Yeah, you know, they're a good team. They're a young team. Um, and, you know, it's part of the thing about being Arizona. Every single time you go out, you know, you're going to get everybody's best shot. They're obviously capable of playing really well, as shown by uh, when they beat Kentucky, you know. Um, but like any other team, including ourselves, you know, they have, they've also had games where they've, uh, they haven't played up to their potential. But they have some great players, um, and they're going to be a challenging matchup for us. And, but I think we're doing everything right right now, and we're going to be well prepared for them uh, and ready to get back on track. Honestly, like we try to keep ourselves pretty insulated. Uh, you know, obviously those games that we've lost on the road, you know, against Baylor, the game against Gonzaga, the game against Oregon, you know, they're all really close games and, you know, could have gone either way with, a, you know, a certain play, you know, if we can get one 50-50 ball or whatever which, you know, gives us confidence that we're capable of beating anyone. But I think it's also, you know, with the team that we have, you know, our freshmen are doing a great job and they're just going to continue to improve. You know, I don't think anybody would say that uh, Zeke was playing better, you know, in October than he, w than he is right now. And, you know, give him another month. I think we're just going to be even better and the chemistry is just continuing to build. Um, so, yeah, I think we're doing a good job with that. And, you know, there's... And there's not a lot of, we try to just, you know, keep it to ourselves. Yeah, I mean, there's definitely, you know, certain uh, things that you, you take away something from every game. Uh, the Oregon game, you know, there were a lot of 50-50 balls that didn't go our way. You know, that was a, a lot of the emphasis. The Oregon State game, uh, you know, they just kind of wore us down a little bit. So I think, you know, the takeaways are... You know, we just have to play together a little bit more and take better shots. Uh, kind of like what I said in the first part of the interview, you know, focusing on shot selection and rebounding. I think if we can kind of hone in on those two things, it'll uh, do us wonders. It's not really one of those things where you have to, I mean, you uh, everybody's obviously going to nitpick, you know, at every single play. But in general, you know, you want to keep it, uh, keep it simple. You know, I think if we focus on rebounding and shot selection and just playing hard and playing together, we'll be all right. Yeah, you know, it's definitely an adjustment, but, you know, I've been here for a year now um, and I, you know, left Cornell kind of knowing that it wasn't, I wasn't going to have the same role. You know, I came here to play on a bigger stage to give myself a better opportunity to uh, play professionally and to win some basketball games, you know, and experience what it's like at a high major program. Uh, and, you know, <clears throat> every transition is going to have its challenges, but, I mean, the only thing I can do is kind of just hang in there and just wait for my opportunity and do the most to take advantage of my opportunity when my number's called.